Well, he is a familiar face at Charger games, but what's the real story behind Bolt Man? For the team's run to the playoffs, we are using the hashtag Bolt's Believer. Well, when it comes to believers, 10 News reporter Bob Lawrence shows us why Bolt Man may be the ultimate believer. Whether he's outside here in the parking lot at the queue for the pregame or inside the stadium during the game, the self-described superfan Bolt Man said he's got but one goal. Get us to the next Super Bowl. Simply put, there may not be a bigger believer than Dan Jureggi, a.k.a. Boltman. First introduced in 1996, Jureggi became a lightning bolt for Charger fans to rally around every time he stepped on the field. The Boltman, I think he's awesome. The getup might have changed over the years, but not the motivation. It's a good feeling to see, um, you know, the fans, um, you know, really wanting to, to come up and, and, you know, get an autograph or a picture. He's not on the field anymore with the team, but he still definitely draws attention in the stands. Listen to this fan's reaction on YouTube. Oh, my God, I hope this is taking it. The 1986 Ramona High School grad has always been a Bolts fan, but aside from being at the Pro Bowl and the Hall of Fame, one memory stands out above them all. You know, shooting out the tunnel with Stan Humphreys, Tony Martin, Natron Means, and and Junior Seau, of course, would probably be the most memorable. As any Charger fan will tell you, there was probably no bigger motivator than number 55. Because he needed a break, Boltman took three seasons off, and the Chargers didn't make the playoffs. He came back this year, and look what's happened. Let's go, Chargers! To see Boltman unmasked, look for the red TV button link on our website. Bob Lawrence, 10 News.